is your full name? My full name is Mandeep Kaur. Can I see your ID? Yes, please. Here it is. Do you work or are you a student? Well, I am a student. I have done graduation from my uh, DAV college and now I am looking forward for higher studies. Tell me about your hometown. Well, uh, my hometown is so big and it's uh, urban. There are a lot of facilities available in my hometown. What does your house look like? My house is a two-story building in which there are three bedrooms, a kitchen and two bathrooms and also a garden. What you can see from the windows of your house? Well, there is a lot of greenery around my house and whenever I am alone in my house, I love to see from the windows uh, about the greeneries, about the fields, which give me a relaxation. Which is your favorite room in your house? In my house, the favorite pa uh, part I like is the lobby uh, where the television is situated and we love to watch the television during evenings. What piece of furniture do you like the most in your house? Well, there is a variety of furniture in my house, but the most one I like is the dining table where my all the member, uh, members love to eat together and spend some quality time. Why you like this particular piece of furniture? I like this particular piece of furniture as uh, all the members are very busy. They do not have enough time. So we only spend some quality time at this furniture. What would you like to do in the future? Well, I am a physics student. Uh, I love to uh, do some more research in the scientific methods and also uh, do some more study. What is the most interesting thing about your country? Well, India is a diverse country. There are a lot of things that are interesting. But the most one I like is that there are different kind of people who belong to different religions and cultures. Which is your favorite place in your country? In my country, there are various places. But I love the most is Golden Temple where uh, I and my family pay obeisance. Okay, let's talk about handwriting. Do you usually write by hand or type? Well, uh, these days I am very busy and uh, also by uh, hand uh, it's uh, sometimes boring and stressful. So I love to write by typing. In what situation it is better to write by hand than type? Well, there are some situations when people have to write by hand to express their emotions and feelings. How much is good handwriting important to you? Well, I think handwriting is very important and good handwriting is so much important that it makes a person, a person more personality and uh, we can also encourage others to do good handwriting. Alright, now I'll give you your two minute topic. You will have one minute to prepare on that topic and you have to speak for one to two minutes and I can stop you in between notes. Okay. Here is your cue card. This is your paper and pencil. May I start? Yes. Well, there is a false saying that promises are made to be broken. However, I personally believe that promises are made to those to whom we love the most. So, breaking promises means losing trust. Even I have done ample of promises to my near and dear ones for some or other reasons. Here, I would like to talk about a promise that I did and which was really uh, difficult for me to achieve. 
as i promised to my mother to achieve good marks in 12th class and it was really difficult for me uh, moreover i started uh, studying about 6 hours a day as it was really tough for me and also i was really weak in math subjects i started taking tuitions from one of our teachers apart from this uh, i was a team member of a school basketball team so i left that as well even my parents got shocked that how i started so much study and then finally uh, i did lot of hard work and although i didn't succeed in my pre exams but i did not lose hope and kept on digging and finally i get finally i passed with good marks uh, with flying colors and then my parents i was over the moon and this was the time then uh, when i made a promise and i achieved it all right can i have paper pencil back yes in this part 3 i'll ask you a few questions related to this topic how do you feel when others break their promises well i do not feel good sometimes uh, it annoys me as people uh, break their promises i think people uh, should think before they make promises do most people fulfill their promises i think these days people do not fulfill their promises as compared to the past times nowadays they just break their promises and even did and even do promises without thinking that whether they fulfill it or not why do you think so well i think these days uh, relationships uh, uh, become more difficult for them to handle and there are also some unavoidable circumstances where they break their promises do indian parents make promises to children yes i think indian parents uh, do promises with their children it sometimes about uh, giving them gifts or rewards uh, if they score well in their academics is it good thing yes i think it, it is a good thing uh, as uh, um, children sometimes do not uh, concentrate on their studies when they hear that their children um, give them some expensive toys then they uh, concentrate easily on their work do children also make promises to their parents if yes what kind of promises they do to my mind children uh, do promises with their parents uh especially uh, according to their uh, education uh, children do promises as they will get good marks in their studies uh, and also it encourage the other students all right this is the end of your speaking thank, thank you. you thank you ma'am